Well, you used to really be scared here. Johnny. Hey, you're still afraid. Stop it now. I mean it. They're coming to get you, Barbara. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Shop 31. I am Randall, your host, as always. Today, today, I was going to do my uh, new movie pickup video. And as I got home from picking up stuff at Best Buy, uh, there was these two big-ass boxes on my porch. So, I'm going to do an unboxing video first, and then I'll do a complete update video. Actually, you know what? I'm going to do this unboxing video, and I'll just throw in what else I got at the end of the unboxing video because it's not a crazy crazy week that'll make this a little bit more fun and it'll be a little bit easier on you guys so happy taco tuesday everybody hope you're having a great day i already had some delicious tacos for lunch i'm gonna have some more delicious tacos from a different place for dinner because that's how i fucking roll um so yeah man thank you for joining me today hope you're having a great afternoon uh it's hot as fucking balls outside uh i think we're gonna be doing a new segment where I just drive around talk shit for a little while on Thursday is called Thursday's Wrong Turn. All right? So, uh, that is something you guys can look forward to. Hopefully, you'll enjoy it. I'm going to do it on YouTube Live Mobile, so it is unedited. You'll see what I do. You'll see how I talk. you see how I act. And uh, there's no way for me to try to cut some stuff out. So, i got to be on my P's and Q's so I don't get myself in some trouble. But uh, anyways, how you doing? How you doing? Let's see. So, I got one box. This down, down here is from Grindhouse Video. This one is from Hamilton Books. So... Um, let's just open them right up. Bam! I love this stuff. Ah, good boxing, too. Hamilton Book kills it with their packaging. I got a bunch of stuff this week, guys. Oh, oh, this one is... I got another Hamilton Book box coming. So this is the, this is the first one. So, oh, I'm really excited about this. Check it out, dude. Catorte. Uh, I got four copies of Ronin. Arrow video release. Um, I wanted to have some for the store, uh, and I obviously didn't have this for myself. So this is one of my favorite De Niro movies. Um, I love this movie. If you haven't seen Ronin yet, get with the program, motherfuckers, motherfuckers. And it has a badass slipcase and everything, dude. This is like maybe my uh, second nicest uh, Arrow release, right behind that RoboCop special edition. This is really nice. I'm very glad I bought this now. Um, so yeah, if you're local, I'll have some of these available at this store. Uh, coming this weekend, you know, Friday through Sunday, 11 to 6. That's badass, man. What a great day. I didn't expect that to be happening. I f honestly, dude, full disclosure, I forgot I ordered all those. That's fucked up. <laughs> so I got this giant box from Grindhouse Video. Let's see what all is in here because I don't remember what I ordered from them either. But a lot of what I order isn't just for me. Um, I order a lot of stuff for the for the shop as well. Oh man, I'm so excited right now. Uh, I'm also at about 945 in my movie collection rebuild. So when I hit that 1,000 mark, uh, let me know. Would you guys like to see an entire series of like maybe two, three, four videos, something in that two to four videos? of a breakdown of all my movies and you can you can see all the stuff that i've got i could probably do let's see like horror blu-ray horror dvd steelbook and boutique and then other so four videos that way they're not you know i don't want to have a two-hour video for you guys i don't think you'd enjoy that let me know if you're interested in that because i'm interested in doing it man these places really package their stuff well i i, I really appreciate that because a lot of times you'll get stuff from say eBay or something and it just comes in these raggedy ass packaging. It's just, it's awful. Ooh, here we go. Okay, so we got Blood and Black Lace, Arrow Video. That's for the store. Um, the Crazies. This, I believe, is one that I don't have. Yeah, this one was mine. Let's see. Oh, I got Alice, Sweet Alice, times two. So I got one for the store. Oh man, it's got a slip cover as well. That's freaking sweet. Um, I got Reanimator for the store. Oh, Reanimator um, movie review. It is legitimately it's coming this week. Uh, I'll have that done hopefully by Friday. Oh yeah, I got a copy of the Crazies for the store too. I got 
Pulse, I've, I just heard of this movie. I don't really know much about it, but I heard it was cool, so I picked it up. It was on, on sale. Um, I got, oh, Terraformers, or Terraformars. I, th I think it's Terraformers is the way I've always heard it. Uh, I got one of those for me, and I got one for this store. And then I picked up uh, Animal Factory. Again, one for me and one for the store. Uh, Animal Factory, I don't know if, man, this, I've never seen an Arrow video in a blue case. This is cool. But it's, uh, Animal Factory is really cool. If you haven't ever heard of it before, it says, uh, Troubled Youth Ron Decker, played by Edward Furlong, American History X fame, and also, obviously, Terminator 2, is sentenced to a 10-year stint in a notorious San Quentin State Prison for a drug-dealing conviction. Inexperienced in the ways of prison life, he's taken under the wing of Earl Copen, played by Willem Dafoe, an experienced con with the entire prison in the palm of his hand, inmates and guards alike. But as Ron grows increasingly cocky in his privilege, uh, in his privileged role as Earl's confidant, uh, is he in danger of biting off more than he can chew with some of the jail's more volatile inhabitants? Based on the semi-autobiography, not autobiographical novel, excuse me, of the same name by Ed, by uh, Edward Bunker, Mister Blue. All right. Um. Animal Factory was Steve Buscemi, uh, his second stint in the director's chair, and sees him marshalling a formidable ensemble cast, including Edward Bunker, Danny Trejo, and Mickey Rourke, for a powerful and sincere account of the men caught up in the penal system and the deals they cut with each other and themselves in order to survive. Um, that was I, I read that horribly, so my apologies. Um, I forgot this was a Steve Buscemi directorial like venture. Um, yeah, dude, Mickey Rourke plays like a, a transvestite in this movie. Oh, this movie is badass, dude. I highly recommend this if you haven't seen it. If you're a fan of like American Me, uh, any of those, uh, prison exploitation movies, one of the best ones ever made right here. The cast is phenomenal, but, uh, yeah, man. So I got a copy for the store. If anybody needs one, let me know. Um, so that's what I, that's what I got in the two boxes today. As for the rest of the week, what I picked up. We got some winners, man. We got some good stuff here. Uh, I got wow. This is a this is a great week as far as just quality, man. Just high quality stuff. I picked up three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri. I just got this one today. I got Countdown because it was like five dollars. It's probably a pretty bad movie, but we'll you know it is what it is. We'll find out. I got Layer Cake. Uh, I just it was it popped up on a couple of lists. I don't know much about it. It came in a collection that I bought, so I snatched it up, brought it home. Uh, Operation Endgame, if you're a fan of, um, oh, what is it called? Uh, movies like The Hunt, uh, Belco Experiment, uh, the one with, um, oh, the, the, the Mayhem. If you're a fan of movies like Mayhem, things like this, uh, then, then you'll like Operation Endgame. It's, they're all in the same vein. Uh, very much a splatter movie. Um, I got Byzantium. I picked this up whenever we decided to uh, watch it last week, and it just showed up yesterday. Fuck yeah, dude. I got Kill Count, Nicolas Cage movie. I already watched it. Uh, this one's unopened. I don't know if it has a digital code, but if it does, I will be giving that away soon. Um, I picked up uh, the Casper 25th Anniversary Steelbook Edition. I got one for me and one for the store. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, they happen to have one copy of Gladiator left on Steelbook, so I snatched that up. Uh, I love steelbooks. These are beautiful, man. This is like artwork to me. Uh, I picked up The Gentleman, not only because I wanted to watch it, but my wife really wanted to watch it again with me, and I, we, we had a good time watching that movie. Um, the Born Ultimate Collection uh, Blu-ray, it was like $20, dude, 22 bucks or something like that. It was ridiculously cheap. All five movies on Blu-ray. I mean, dude, 4K is not good enough for me to pass up that deal. Um, I picked up Oh Brother, Where Art Thou on DVD, again, for like a dollar. 88 minutes on DVD, really good Pacino flick. Uh, Broken Arrow, man, one of those uh, early what early 2000s, late 90s Travolta flicks that are just like, uh, I mean, underrated, man. These are fun movies. What year was this one? I do not know what year this one was. My apologies, folks. Uh, and then the original Highlander, dude, come on. I am immortal, dude. Queen fucking killed that soundtrack. And then last but not least, I got this really beautiful beautiful this is the best looking uh uh slip cover that i've ever seen thus far okay i've seen a lot of really nice ones especially lately 
but this one here is freaking gorgeous man it's got this high gloss uh artwork here and then it's like flat uh satin black the rest of the case is flat it's even on the back it's the same way look at that high gloss with the oh my goodness this thing is really pretty and this is a this is a i think i think french release but it's not available in america that's for sure but um yeah headhunter man that's a that's a wild ass movie it's a very short movie you should check that one out folks um but yeah that's what i picked up this week i hope you guys picked up some great movies let me know what y'all get uh i'm very I, I, nobody ever tells me what they picked up i'm, I'm really interested in that uh, that's part of this that I love to do is to find out what you folks got. So, but thanks for joining me. Hope you had a good time. Go enjoy some Tuesdays, uh, some Tuesday. Yeah, go enjoy Tuesday, fucking a, you know. But uh, go enjoy some tacos on Taco Tuesday. Go out and hang out with your buds and, uh, you know, grab some tacos. All right, folks. Thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. I'm Randall. This is the Shop Thirty One. You guys, the shit. We'll see y'all next time, man. Uh, don't forget we got movie reviews coming very soon. Oh, if you want to check us out on social media or Patreon, or do a donation to the channel, whatever, whatever, you know. All that information is down below in the description below. I want to spend, send a special thank you to all my page, Patreon members. I got a, I got about a dozen of you guys that really, really help a lot, man. So thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I very much appreciate that. Um, yeah, man, I don't want to ever forget that y'all are out there helping me out. Y'all make this stuff possible. So thank you again. I'll see you guys soon. Y'all be good. Have a good evening. Peace.